we are, man. Makaiva. To do what? Go camping. Hiking. With our baby? With Sequoia. So we're loading up. Pretty much ready to go. It's probably 2.30. Windy, really hot for a winter day. Walk about three miles to Camp Cozy and then Primitive Camp. We've been there a few times before, haven't been in a couple years, so it should be a fun, mellow experience, hopefully. It is pretty windy. Might see some rain later, but that's part of the fun. Look at the Camp Cozy sign. Camp Cozy. Just left the parking lot. Got a bunch of new gear to test out. New sleeping bags, new tents, new backpacks for the dog. One for the human. onto the trail. Got a little greeting from the gatekeeper here. The gopher, right? Gopher tortoise. They're endangered, so we're not going to mess with them too much. Sequoia, be nice. Uh-uh. <laughs> Check out that one part of his shell. It looks like he got, like, hurt or something. Right? Leave him be and keep going. This is the more of the trail as opposed to the dirt road that you can walk on. It's a little bit more shaded. Okay, come on, he had a prescribed mm -hmm. burn here. He's so cute. Look at his little butt. He's cute. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. He's cute. So we're going to continue on here. And link up with you at the campsite. Boom! We are uh, taking a little break. <laughs> Come here. Taking a little break on the trail. We've been at it for 30 minutes. This is kind of the lay of the land. Lots of scrub brush and pine forest. It's the hottest day it's been all winter. We're definitely in like the mid 80s, which is kind of weird because it's been really cold the last couple days. So, keep on keeping on. How are you feeling? I'm just happy to be here. All right, we've made it to camp. This is actually Big Buck Camp. We opted for the river option here. So, it's got a nice canopy of trees, lots of shade, but it also has a pretty killer water source, the river. So we're gonna kinda head that way. Just a nice little gradual downhill. Looks like they cleared a little bit of this out. I don't see any wood, do you? Mm. You're rough. Kind There's of. some. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to have to scour to find some. But we will. Dock your canoe and walk up to the campsite. Kind of like a marshy wetland, lots of cypress and oak trees. Yep, there she goes. There she goes. 
definitely have to watch out for wildlife, gators and whatnot. The water is super clear. You just gotta be on your toes out here. It smells so nice. <laughs> Coming back up from the water source, took a little swim and grabbing a bucket of water to filter and drink. So we're walking back up now. Lots of fish in there. It's getting kind of later in the day, it's already four, so we need to start scouring for wood and setting up camp it's gonna get dark in about two hours so I will get things going and check in with you when we get everything set up all right all right we've uh, set up camp more or less got the hammock system going over here and the tent behind me. Cook some food. Sun's gonna go down and... I'm talking to the camera, actually. <laughs> anyway, uh, sun's gonna go down an hour and a half. Puppy's already tired. So, weather looks good. Probably go on a sunset hike in a little bit. Sunset high. Going on another sunset high. Oh boy, look at that. Much better than that. It's like they're pink on the bottom and purple on the top. Yeah, there's absolutely been some legendary sunsets out here. We have pictures to prove it, but my favorite one was. When we were with, was it Nick and Nikisa or Nick and Mug and we went out here and it was ridiculous. Was it like the hot pink? Ooh, look at that. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I should have got my phone to take photos. Wow, look at that. Boom. That is crazy. Look at the clouds that way. I love it with the trees on top though. sunset we are looking at and going to be looking at that sunset's worth $85 <laughs> it's worth more than $85 we're talking about how much they were trying to charge us to rent a canoe and we decided to hike in which I'm glad we did because we wouldn't have gotten such a great sunset spot right here. And it is wow. beaming. It's like neon orange, like right where the sun is, and then the clouds are all purple and blue, and then the like edges of the clouds are all like hot pink to light pink. Yeah, it's ridiculous. survive barely we're leaving camp now 
We're all packed up, we're ready to get out of here. Crazy night, thunderstorms, 40 mile per hour winds, lightning, thunder. But we stayed dry and warm, so it was good. <laughs> all right, so we're gonna take off before it starts to rain again. Hey, what's up? This is the memory camp, and I'm back from the camp out in Wakaiva. Just got back to the car. What a time it was. Storm hit, huge storm hit in the middle of the night, around 12, 40 mile per hour winds. Did not let up till 4 or 5 in the morning. Um, I had a new tent, which held up fine. There was a little bit of water that got through, but in all honesty, I didn't set it up exactly how I should have. I kind of, it's a new tent, so I was just kind of running through it, and that storm was hardcore, so I'm pretty happy with it. Stayed really warm in my new sleeping bag, which is great. Um, just kind of out of it. Didn't sleep too much because of the storm, because I was running around, trying to save as much as I could, but all in all, great trip, great time. So, I will see you again out there. Thank you so much for watching, and please like and subscribe if you dig what you see. Later.